guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my very first makeup declutter video. I went through my makeup the other day and I just want to get rid of a lot of it. I'm going to research if I can donate it to anywhere in my area. I'm not 110% sure if I can. Um, if I do find somewhere that I can donate this makeup to, I will link it down below and like let you know in the comments that I am donating some of the makeup. And I'll tell you like what I would donate and what I would just completely throw away in this video. So if you want to see all the makeup I am getting rid of, then keep watching. Alright, so this is the box of makeup and we have a lot. I'm just gonna... I'm not going to go in any specific order at all. So the first thing I'm getting rid of are these Fleur eyeshadows. Um, this was a brand at Kohl's like forever ago. They were kind of just like my first eyeshadows, so it was kind of like hard to get rid of them. But they're just, they were never really like the best eyeshadows. They're really hard to blend, hard to work with. They're like super dry and that's just something I would completely throw away. Next thing is this busted beauty gems palette um i got this for christmas a couple years ago and the lid just completely fell off the colors the colors are gorgeous they're all shimmers which is like the one downside um but it fell and all the colors just got all messed up and then there's like you push one of the sides the side here and it's just a bunch of like blushes and lipsticks and like the lipsticks got all gross and it's just like not worth saving anymore and i never really reach for it so that's just why this i'll probably throw away also just because of how broken it is and gross next up are these two revlon like cream shadow things i'm i just don't like them the colors are okay this one has like your silver a gold a bronze and then like a rosy gold shade and then this one has a white black silver and then like a pink um these i'll probably just throw away also because i feel like they're really used up and probably dried out as well Next thing here is a, literally, I wish I was joking, a Claire's palette. Um, I actually used to use this forever ago. The shadows aren't that bad, but I just don't use it. I mean, this might be something I would donate. I'll probably buy, like, alcohol and spray them all down before I donate them. Next up is this weird brand. It's called Color Impact Charming Eyes. This used to be, like, my favorite palette in high school because it was all purples. But this shade right here is completely gone and the shadows are meh so this is just gonna go right in the garbage the maybelline the rock nudes palette i will definitely donate if i can this is just this palette stinks the colors are really nice but the, it's horrible the palette's terrible i've used it in two pal two tutorials i mean and it's just it's not good at all so this I'll donate because I've barely used it. I've used it probably like three or four times total. Another Maybelline palette. This is just like a little Maybelline one. This is called Hushed Tints. Um, I've never used this. My sister gave it to me actually, but I just, I'm not a fan of the colors and it looks like super lightly used. Again, I'll just clean this off and spray down with like some alcohol, but this I'll probably donate if I can find somewhere as well. This LA Colors palette I used to use all the time you can tell i hit pan i completely hit pan on this shade right here and then this shade right here i hit pan on as well it's white so you can't really tell but um this i don't use anymore either i'm gonna throw it away it's old next is this Too faced palette um this is the glamour to go palette i don't like the lip things in here in here i hate when palettes have lip things honestly and the shades are okay in this i like them but i don't love them i used this green one in a saint patrick's day tutorial and i don't know i if i can clean it up okay i will donate it if i again um but if i can't clean it i'm just gonna throw it away this is the elf little black beauty book cool edition um i have two of these so i thought i would just you know get rid of this one um just because i don't need to and the colors i mean they're pretty vibrant colors so this would be a donation next we have this avon i'm pretty sure this is avon this is a true color eyeshadow quad in lilac dream um i don't know how to open it oh 
it's just like some nice purple shadows but i just never use them like ever i'll probably throw this away too just because it's really old and it's been sitting in my drawer for years next we have two of these maybelline uh color tattoo by i studio pots uh this one is in emerald it's edgy emerald sorry it's like a green blue color really pretty and then this one is in fierce and tangy which is this orange one um these dried out like really fast i'm assuming so these are garbage next i'm getting rid of this nyx eyebrow cake powder um i just don't use this anymore i don't like love it or hate it i like pencils better and i don't think this would match so i'm just gonna throw it away another thing i'm throwing away is this prestige brow perfection ideal match marbleized brow pencil um i don't love this pencil it was okay i just don't think it would match Ew, it's moldy. Ew, I didn't even know that. Ew, ew. Oh, no, that's hairs. I don't know what's going on with this pencil, but it just needs to be thrown away. Two more eyeshadow things I'm getting rid of are... Oh, this is another Prestige Cosmetics. I've never seen that brand before. I know I got it in Ulta, but I've never seen, like, any other things. But this is a light, loose, shimmering shadow pigment or dust in the shade i don't know because there's no name but it's like a blue color and then this is the same thing but maybelline and it's in this romantic pink i never use these they look i think i tried this pink one like one time just playing around and it looked absolutely horrible so i'm throwing both of these away as well next thing i'm throwing out is this Too faced shadow insurance it's water it's literally water i don't know what happened i never got to use it and the one day i went to use it it was like water just came out of it don't buy that i don't know what's wrong with it the next i have all foundations so first thing is this elf foundation serum i did not like this it didn't do anything and i don't know what is going on here it like got stuck or something so next thing i have here is this revlon color stay foundation in 240 medium beige yeah i don't like this and it doesn't match my skin at all Another eyeshadow palette that I didn't see in there was this Wet n Wild like trio in Don't Steal My Thunder. And it's just like, it's literally two silver shades and a black, unless the one shade is supposed to be white. Um, I don't use, I will not use this. I'll throw this away. This, I don't really do these like black and silver smoky eyes anymore. I'm not in high school anymore when I used to do those literally every day. Next is this e.l.f. tinted moisturizer. This makes me look like an Oompa Loompa. So I'm just going to donate it and hopefully someone doesn't look like an Oompa Loompa too. Next I'm throwing away this American Beauty Perfectly Even Natural Finish Foundation. Um, This is just really old. This is in the shade 06 Light Medium Cool. I'm not cool those look, don't look good on me this was too light and yeah this is just old this was an old brand at Kohl's like forever ago next I have the elf acne fighting foundation um I did a review on this a while back and I just never used it ever again I didn't love it and I didn't hate it I just don't use it I found better foundations I really did like the packaging though how it had this like really nice squeezy tube thing squeezy tube that I just you know spill all over the box but yeah I just don't use this anymore so I'm gonna probably donate this I was trying to sell this on my Poshmark but no one bought it and I closed my Poshmark by the way if any of you are wondering or care so the last foundation is the L'Oreal Infallible Total Cover Full Coverage Weightless Feel Foundation in 305 Natural Beige I hated this this was so gross like just talking about it skews me out I really do not like it at all and because i got it from best agent i think i have to throw it away because like you're not supposed to give it away at all and this would be too dark for my mom or my sister and neither of them will like it because they don't wear like full coverage foundations totally last but not least but in this walmart bag i have a whole lot of chapsticks that i'm getting rid of and lip glosses I'm not going through everything in this bag or else we will be here for probably five years. But I'm just throwing them all away. I mean, I have these NYX ones, these NYX like soft matte lip creams that I don't like at all. These e.l.f. things that smell like Benadryl, like all this stuff that like I will never wear. My sister gave me a bunch of lip products and they're all so pinky, like they're Barbie pink and I just want to vomit every time I look at them. 
so yeah i'm getting rid of all these lip products and it's just like old chapstick like it's a lot it's a lot a lot if you saw them in my vanity tour like i'm getting rid of everything that was in that one drawer and that is all the makeup i am getting rid of like i said if i can find somewhere that i am donating to i will let you guys know in the comments down below if i do end up finding somewhere i still have to do my research on that if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to hit that red button down below to subscribe to my channel Follow me on all my social media. That's always linked down below in the description box as well. If you guys have any video suggestions on any videos you want to see me do in the future, let me know in the comments down below. Or if you just want to leave a comment saying, hey, please do that too. I love getting your comments. And that is all I have to say. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.